welcome to my channel Flavor Sun. My name is Emily. Today I'm going to show you how to make my own stuffed peppers. This recipe is very easy to make and it's not that much ingredients that you need. Of course I will put the description below what kind of ingredients that you need for this particular recipe. But before the end of this video guys, please give us a like, leave us some comments and of course subscribe. And now let's start with our ingredient. But before that, we're gonna go ahead and preheat our oven for a 350 Fahrenheit. And of course, we're gonna do our uh, pepper. Uh, my recipe is I have to boil my peppers into the boiled water for about maybe two minutes. Like I said, I will put the description below of the recipe how to do step by step, step by step process. So I'm gonna have a a uh, big pot right here. I'm going to put just the water in here. Just kind of like putting them to boil, so we can put our uh, so we can put our stuffed peppers in there. So I think this is about enough. So now, uh, and now we're gonna cut our peppers. So basically, this one it's not they're all the same look. So you have to cut it there on the side a little bit to make sure that is um, balanced with the pepper stem. Just like this. This we're just gonna cut a little bit. There. There you go. Ta-da! Stand up now. A little bit more. Make sure that when you cut doesn't have the hole. Say I make the hole a little bit, but that's okay. I'm just gonna put lots of sauce in there. Okay? There you go. We have our one pepper. And we're gonna have another one. Okay, now let's check it out our peppers um, to make sure that they're all even. First, I'm going to cut in the top of the peppers so that way I can take it out all the seeds inside. You want to use your finger or anything that you like. You don't want knife, you can do that, but I use knife for me. Just kind of like twist a little bit so that way there's no seeds inside. As you can see, I still have a little bit more. I just use my hands and dump it like this. If you don't want to do that, go ahead and do what the, what's the best for you. And there you go, our clean peppers. It's ready to go to my boiling pot. And of course, I'm using this uh, sauce. It's a uh, ragu tomato garlic onion. This is my favorite one, so you can use a, any brand and any sauce that you like. But I would prefer this one myself because I've tried it before and I like it. First, here is our beef. This is one pound of beef. I have this one in my freezer and I uh, defrost them uh, this morning today. And so this is one pound of ground beef. I'm using ground beef this time. Okay, so let's go start our uh, sauce for our peppers. First, I'm going to add my uh, our olive oil just a little to saute our ingredients and kind of like make sure that it's not a lot. First, we're going to put our garlic and kind of like brown it and then next we'll add, 
adding our onions and kind of like saute them until it's brown or caramelized a little bit and then after that we add our ground beef and this is the time that you are just going to mix them well to make sure that this ground beef are cooked evenly add our little bit of soy sauce and now we're going to add our Worcestershire sauce and just kind of mix it well spaghetti sauce I use spaghetti sauce mine you can use any sauce that you like but I use mine as spaghetti sauce it's gonna mix it well and turn into a boil for two minutes in the low medium heat and now my peppers it's ready I boiled my peppers about two minutes I make sure that it's still tender and you don't want to overcook your peppers this is just enough to go into the oven to have a tender and nice juicy peppers to put our rice I use mine I think um, one cup of rice but if you want it more you can do that as well and we're going to add our parmesan cheese I use half cup of parmesan cheese and also later on we're going to add our shredder, shredded cheese I also use half cup for it and then kind of like mix it all together until it blends and let's go ahead and put the peppers um, first I put shredded cheese for it and then I um, go along with our rice and sauce that we mix it earlier together just kind of scoop it out to make sure that they are even and looks pretty right now so just gonna keep doing it until they're all full of stuff and let's go ahead add our little bit parmesan cheese on top of the of the stuffed peppers just to make sure that we can taste evenly our cheese in it I also go ahead and add our uh, mozzarella cheese on top of the peppers just because we love cheese you can pick any cheese you like but I have just mozzarella cheese and also in the toppings is sliced mozzarella cheese as well now we're just waiting for our stuffed pepper to be cooked it's in the oven for 20 with ground beef and of course a lot of cheese this looks so perfect and so delicious look at that cheese right there that's how I like it and hope you guys enjoy this recipe you can also visit our website www.flavorsum.com and of course we are going to put description below for all the step-by-step -step process with the ingredients and the recipe and before the end of this video guys please don't forget to give us a like leave us some comments and of course subscribe our channel flavor sum remember cooking is fun you got to have a flavor sum see you guys next week thanks for watching